This is our mercantile building. It's got a sampling of some of the things that were for sale, now, like at a hardware store in the old days, between 18 and 1900. Mercantile stores were very important because that got you all your supplies that you needed, the, the hardware type stuff that you needed, not like the grocery store. You go in there because you have to or, <laughs> or you need something and, and you know they have it. My guess is they had probably 20 customers a day or, or thereabouts. And Saturdays, Saturday was the day that everybody come to town. But during the week probably was not very busy all the time. This is just a sampling of the hard, or mercantile or hardware stores of the old time. They were usually a lot bigger than this. Uh, space has made us shrink it down. The old uh, hardware and mercantile stores always smelled of leather because uh, they always did leather. This is a, the typical kitchen range in the, in the old days. Made a lot of heat in the house because you, know, you fired them with wood so it was just like a furnace all the time. So the old houses had a lot of windows in it so in the summertime they opened windows so they kind of keep the house cool. I pushed one of those for several hours when I was a kid. <laughs> Didn't like it then either. <laughs> this is a uh, cherry pitter. Um, you put your cherries in there and turn the crank and it would, it would take the, the cherry pits out. This is an old hand crank meat grinder. You grind and you put your chunks of meat in it and grind the meat up. If you have a sausage and you put it in here, which is a sausage stuffer, you clean the intestines and out real good and you put them on there and you shove them in and that was a sausage stuffer. A waffle iron that you can set, was set on the, on the, the wood burning uh, kitchen range. That's both sides of the waffle, just kind of like at the, when you get a waffle at the hotel. This uh, is one of the very first electric refrigerators and this is in the 1930s when this one came out. This thing right here was used in the uh, chuck wagons for like on a cattle drive or a wagon train. You put all your different things into your coffee, your flour, your sugar, and it was a dispenser for, for that. And like everything, even in the old days, if you didn't see it, we can order it. <laughs> <laughs>